Hello, how are you? Welcome. Can you introduce yourself and show us your name card as well so that we can... I thank you. My name is Tinai Eshe Mutazu. I'm Director of Water Resources Planning and Development and the Minister of Water Resources Development and Management in Zimbabwe, that's down Southern Africa. Mm -hmm. And here at World Water Week, this is your first World Water Week, you said. What, what are you expecting from it? All right, thank you very much. Um, this is indeed my first uh, ever World Water Week. Uh, I was really embraced and attracted by the uh, theme for this year, which talks about uh, urbanization mm -hmm. and water. And from a Zimbabwean perspective, we have had challenges relating to urbanization and water, especially in the last couple of years when we had a serious cholera outbreak in the urban centers. While traditionally we have had episodes of cholera, they tended to be in the rural areas. But uh, uh, in the 2008-2009 period, where we had over 4,000 cases in the urban centers only, wow. it became necessary that we revisit our urban water and sanitation situation. And when mm -hmm. this came up, I just thought there were a few lessons to learn. And yes. this is where I came up. And what is the government already seeking to do um, to sanitize water in the urban areas? All right. Government has uh, established these mechanisms at the moment that are seeking to address this challenge. While at the time we immediately impacted on uh, resource mobilization because we realized our infrastructure had really gone down, we have arrested that situation now and we are in the process of now revisiting our own. Uh, policies and um, everything around it and government has impact on a broad sector review of the policies that govern water use and in particular the treatment of waste water and you will not in Zimbabwe at the moment we uh, have impact on a rewriting so to say the national water policy and the okay. organization of the sector as a whole here. That's very exciting for Zimbabwe to have this progress in the future. Uh, thank you very much. Yes, we really are at the moment as well visiting neighboring countries, getting on study tours to learn from countries that have gone through the process of uh, sector review. We have been to Ghana, mm -hmm. we plan to visit Zambia, and we also plan to visit South Africa, who we think uh, we can get a few lessons which we should then use in our sector policy review. Great. Thank you very much for sharing.